<laughs> We're back. I have, I have successfully, successfully dominated, dominated this puny resistance, puny resistance of the of heroes. heroes. And now, now the fate, the fate of, the of the earth, earth is in my hands. Now, now to end, end this war once, once and for all and, and dominate this world under my command. command. No, no more, more trying to be unique, unique and, and special. special. I, will I will use the cheapest the tactic to win this battle. battle. Heroes, Heroes deserve, deserve no, no mercy. mercy. Bring it on, foolish mortals. <laughs> ah, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> anyway, so from my last video, I did the heroes 100% and was disappointed there was no final battle with Galactus, which would have been epic. So now I'm gonna do the hero side. Now, <coughs> main reason why I'm doing these 100% videos is because I thought if you got 100%, you would unlock the colors for each of the sides. Because I believe heroes unlocks Capcom and Heroes Unlock Marble for the Silver Sulfur colors but uh, you know I haven't gotten any messages that I have unlocked them and when I went to check you know I really didn't got anything so I'm kinda wondering if they're gonna do this by the end of the week or at least provide more details on how to get these kind of uh, custom colors or maybe if they're only available for arcade or burst mode or training mode which I haven't really checked hmm. We're gonna have to get to that later. So that may that may be a thing to avoid online gameplay with you know people using the same silver silver colors because it w it would I imagine it would be very confusing to see let's say two Weskers with the, with this alternative color. So uh, I'm gonna have to check if it's even available for arcade or versus or what's going on there because I I well. You already know <laughs> by watching the title that I, I, I won and I got uh, both heroes and heroes in 100% but I received nothing. Now this was an interesting battle because the you know the opponent was isn't using powerful cards and <laughs> he's parrying everything I'm throwing at him. <laughs> I was actually afraid I was gonna lose this match. So Alright, so sorry about that. My my dad came in and I had to stop recording. Because <laughs> he, he turns on the TV and it you know, I can't hear anything anymore. So anyways, um, as I was saying, uh, I'm gonna check those uh, alternative colors, but uh, uh, here, as you see, I finally... <laughs> uh, just for the heck of it, I taunted Firebrand. Uh, now, I'm liking this mode a lot. The only thing is that online play, well, as Smashing Manly put it uh, in short, uh, it all it's all a matter of being the cheapest guy. The cheaper you are, the more successful you will be in Heroes and Heralds, which is, which I guess is nice. But I wanted, you know, I wanted to have more fun with it. I, I, want, I wanted to use uh, decks of cards that improve the skills of characters that are lacking, like kind of like Iron Fist and Arthur. So it's kind of sad to see that the people are just abusing this and using the cheapest tactics instead of trying to use characters they never used before. But Oh well, I'm under the minority here, so my opinion doesn't really count because uh, everyone's gonna be cheap, and this mode is not to be taken seriously, which I think it's kind of a problem. But uh, needless to say, uh, I'm gonna try to do combo videos with these uh, special ability cards at least to put them to good use. I only have 83%, so I'm still missing a lot of cards. I really want to get Thanos for the pairing. But uh, thank you for watching. Until the next video I, I upload, uh, take care and happy gaming. Lights.